have you always struggled with getting closer to your buffet for your body type you've attended all online classes telegram classes you are literally following all of the celebrities we know on instagram just in the bid for you to actually know what will work for you or you have been struggling buying clothes that don't suit your body type or end up not flaunting the features that you intend to flaunt so if this is you my darling i got you in five videos i'm going to be telling you everything you need to know about your particular body type your uniqueness your futures all of the things you need to know in order for you to purchase or buy clothes that'll be suitable for your particular body type for you to flaunt or to balance your future welcome back to my channel my darlings my name is victory is a geo image and style coach you know what i do already but if you don't okay i'm gonna tell you i teach young women how to couple clothes together in order to feel amazing proud about themselves whenever they are done styling i also teach them how to build your self-identity in order to create formidable first impressions whenever they step out of their house okay so if this is you or you love what it sounds like i do recommend that you subscribe click that subscribe button all right and join the community of elegant women who are looking to elevate their style who are looking to develop a personal style to communicate who they are to the public if you're a returning subscriber my darling welcome back to another video i promise this is going to be an exciting one i asked the pool last week what video do you want to see from me this week and i got quite a response i got 71 percent vote on number one or a option and uh nothing on the b and i think about 29 percent on the c option so number a or number one option was recommended close for each body type so that is what i have come to give you in today's video in today's video i'm just going to be talking about the white hips the pear shape the triangle body type if you are a triangle body type if you are a white hip if you're a pear shape this video is for you and if you know anyone who actually is a pear shape i recommend that you share this video to them okay so how do you know your body type how do you know that you are a pear shape or a wide hips or a triangle body type well i have done a video on how to know your body type how to actually determine your body type i've done a whole video on that and i recommend that you do that but i'm going to touch it just briefly into this video okay if you don't know whether you're a pear shape or whether you're a wide hip or whether you are a triangle body type well i need you to do something very quickly for me look yourself at the mirror and determine what part of your body is more in proportion because that is how to determine your body type like i've already said i have a whole video that will tell you in detail how to determine your particular body type look yourself at the mirror look at your body find out which part of your body that is most essential and in order for you to do this i need you to take your bust your waist your hip and your shoulders in consideration because these are the essential body parts that are needed for you to actually know which body type that you are and it is very important for me to actually make this um difference there's a difference between your body size and your body type your body size is size eight to size you know to the plus size so you can be a small or petite peer shape and you can be a plus size peer shape or wide hip or a triangle body type yeah so there's a difference between body type and body size know that okay how we're gonna do this today i'm gonna put the clothes that are recommended for your particular body type i'm going to put it in categories and tell you why each cloth is actually very good and why you should avoid certain clothes i'll be mentioning in today's video for this particular body type what you are looking to do to your body is either to balance it or to flaunt that is actually what we are going to be talking about throughout the series for this particular body type you're looking to either flaunt your hip or you're looking to either balance it to actually balance out with the rest of your body that is literally what we're going to be talking about in today's video. For the triangle body type, for the pear shape, the most obvious pronounced part of your body are your hips. Your hip is so distant, so pronounced, so obvious. And when it comes to your shoulder down to your waist, it's narrow. And then when it comes to your hip, it widens out. What are the options? What are the clothes options available for this particular body type that will enable you to flaunt or balance it, you know, to be equal? portion with the rest of your body parts okay so let's go right into the tops that are recommended for this particular body type tops that are recommended for this particular body type okay so you don't really have any problem in top so if you're looking to balance your silhouette you want to go for a more pronounced more exaggerated tops that will bring the attention to the upper part of your body not the lower part of your body because the lower part of your body is very obvious and if you want to keep it contained well i would advise you to actually go for tops that are exaggerated tops that are pronounced 
pronounced tops like bell sleeves very um exaggerated designs tops that have a waist very pronounced tops embellished tops these are the kind of tops you can go if you're looking to balance your silhouettes another top that you can go for apart from the embellished top if you're looking to um balance your silhouette you can go for tops that are longer that can you know cover your hips but i need you to pay attention to not cutting yourself in half with the kind of length of tops that you go for because you need to pay attention to what we call the third rule the third rule is wearing a top that is actually going to you know come down below your hip area they will cut you in half literally it will make you look shorter than you are so if you're not short it will make you actually look shorter and if you're short it will make you look shorter than you already are so pay attention to that if you are looking to balance then pay attention to the length of top if you're looking to you know go for a more lengthy top make sure that you're going for the length of top that is not going to cut you in half that is not going to make you look shorter pay attention to that if you're looking to balance it okay so let's go to the tops that you are going to use if you want to flaunt your hip it's too good for you to be flaunted. So the top that are suitable for flaunting this particular body type is the tank top. Tank tops would do amazing for you, honestly. Tank tops are amazing. I mean, tank tops, you can get it in so many colors. You can get it in black, you can get it in white, you can get it in, you know, busy colors first before you start adding colors that are suitable for your skin tone. When you go with tank top, you can decide to talk in when you go with the tank top, talking with either your trousers or your skirt. That will actually bring out the you know <laughs> the whole this particular body type is really mistaken for the hourglass there is a difference between the hourglass and the pear shape the difference is the shoulders for the hourglass the shoulder is usually more in proportion with the hips for the pear shape the shoulder is narrower when you measure it the shoulder is narrower than the hips so that is the basic difference between the pear shape and the hourglass because you may be thinking that you are hourglass but you are actually pear shape and you keep on buying things that are suitable for the hourglass but why you are pear it may not really be good for you that is why it is so essential for you to purchase clothes that are suitable for your particular body type from there you can do your personal style for the tank top tank tops are a bay if you're looking to flaunt the particular body type another top that is also good is crop tops crop tops would do amazing for you to actually flaunt this particular silhouette it is just too good i mean you can get it in so many colors and you can actually combine it with a trouser if you're looking to go to a casual event or you're looking to go to a lunch date or looking to go to brunch date with whoever it is or when you're going to work you can pair it you can layer with a blazer if you're looking to flaunt all right so another thing on the top is your blazers your blazers is actually so important the way you style your blazers can either determine whether you want to balance or whether you want to flaunt so when you actually talk in your blazers that means you want to flaunt it when you leave your blazers to fly traditionally the traditional way of wearing blazers you want to balance your silhouette so to achieve a balance or a flaunt with respect to your blazers it depends on how you style that particular blazer and also it depends on the particular blazer because you have blazers that are cropped up so if you choose a cropped up blazer that particular blazer can also help to flaunt but if you choose a long line you know blazer that's up on your hip well it can actually do the magic for you too you know balance your silhouette okay another type of blazer is the coat drawn down kind of gown coat that particular coat is actually good if you're looking to balance if you're looking to layer you know to balance your silhouette let's go to the bottoms recommended bottoms for this particular body type in order for you to flaunt or to um balance your silhouette let's go to jeans first if you go for pencil trousers you're looking to front because it's going to you know make it so obvious it's going to bring out your hip in your particular style and it's going to bring out your hip in your particular outfit if you're looking to go with that that will flaunt it but if you're not looking to flaunt your hip you want to balance it you can go for a straight cut jeans you can go for a mom's jeans but mom's jeans is actually very very amazing you can also go for cut trousers but cut trousers is actually very very nice honestly so straight cut trousers when you're looking to balance and for pencil trousers when you are looking to you know flaunt your hip i need to point something out right now for this particular body type you need to differentiate between your upper body and your lower body so i would recommend that you choose different colors when you're styling you can go for brown on the upper side and go for black on the down side it is very essential because your upper body part is narrow and it's not really that balanced so for you to actually create a balance while creating a flaunt if you want to flaunt you need to differentiate between 
see your upper part and your lower part and that is when you have to play around with colors when we're talking about colors i'm talking about playing around with a different kind of color when you're standing your upper part and then a different kind of color when you're standing your lower part so you can go for a black on the upper part and go for a brown on the lower part or you can go for a white or you can go for a green or you can go for whatever but make sure that the colors that you're using to start is not monochrome it should be different in order for your waist to be defined in order for your upper body to be defined it is so essential it will actually help you balance and also help you flaunt whatever you choose to do let's go to skirt what are the skirts that are recommended for this particular body type you can go for the pencil skirt pencil skirt are really amazing for this particular body type when you're looking to flaunt your body type or when you're looking to flaunt your silhouette you can style with one of those embellished tops that we've talked about earlier the peplum top the bell slit top it is going to really be amazing if you're looking to balance your silhouette if you're not looking to you know make your hip more obvious than it already is i would recommend that you go with a straight cut skirt a skirt straight cut skirt it is amazing for this particular body type and also pleated skirt too are suitable so amazing for this particular body type because mm, when you are done styling baby and when you come out they're gonna uh, so you're gonna look snatched okay when we go to accessories i'm gonna tell you the key accessories that you actually need but first let's finish with the clothes okay <laughs> so let's go over to the gowns. what are the recommended gowns for this particular body type for the pure shape body type what are the recommended gowns for you if you are looking to flaunt your body type or you're looking to flaunt your hip you can go for the pencil gown pencil gowns are amazing pencil gowns are going to you know help you accentuate help you flaunt help you you know put your hips out there i'm like okay i got this pencil gowns are actually very very nice for your particular body type if you're looking to flaunt your hip if you're really really you know secured about your hips and you want to flaunt you can go with pencil gowns pencil gowns are amazing and they are in different colors they are in different styles so incorporate pencil gowns pencil gowns and actually okay so you can switch it up with you know straight cut gowns and all of that if you're looking to balance your silhouette you can go for the straight cut gowns the a-line gowns all of those gowns those gowns are actually very very suitable and they are also going to be amazing i need you to know something for this particular body type you can choose to either balance or flaunt or you can mix it there are times you may want to flaunt your particular body type or your particular silhouette and there are times you may choose to balance so incorporate closer can help you achieve these two things because whenever you're styling the key thing when it comes to styling yourself or when it comes to styling your particular body shape is to either achieve a flaunt or achieve a balance so these are the two things that should drive your salary so you can wake up one morning and be like i want to flaunt what i got today so you can choose any of your clothes from your closet to achieve that particular purpose for you so that is one thing you need to know when it comes to styling yourself you are either achieving a flaunting or you're achieving a balancing it's very important for you to know this okay when it comes to accessories what are the key accessories that are suitable that are recommended for this particular body type number one is belt belts are a go-to for this particular body type in fact for every body type belts are so important because belts enables you to accentuate your waist keep your waist you know contain keep your waist distant because your upper body is not really as balanced as the hourglass so if you want to achieve an hourglass body shape or hourglass body type you need to work with belt how can you combine all of this when you're getting an embellished top, a statement top, and then you're going with something like an A-line skirt. So how can you make this outfit look classy, look stylish, make anybody that will pass you turn back to look at you again? It's with belt. When you add a belt to this particular combination, forget it. It is giving everything it is supposed to give. That is why belt are so important. Belt creates a statement belt makes your eye to be stuck belts are so important for every body type all of the body types belts are so important and you can use belt to either style for a brunch or dinner or formal or whatever belts are so handy and that is the basic accessories and then for every other accessories like a miscellaneous scarves are also very very important so that is everything about the recommended clothes recommended accessories for this particular body type i hope this video was educating i hope this video was insightful in order for you to go ahead to purchase clothes that are suitable for your body type and feel amazing with your shopping experience whenever you're done shopping i hope this was really detailed and um really touched your key concerns but if it didn't please let me know in the comments and i will surely address that 
in the comments i promise you that is all we've come to the end of this video and the next video is going to be about the recommended clothes for the inverted triangle body type and in that particular video i'm going to be telling the inverted body type the particular clothes that are suitable for your particular body type and how to flaunt and how to balance your particular body type in order to achieve an amazing class and style whenever you're done styling okay my social media handles are displayed on the screen please go ahead to engage and if you have not subscribed please go ahead to subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video god bless